Okay, we're back. <clears throat> and as you can hear, I have the TV tuned to channel 31. And there's just nothing but static on there. Like as though there's no station on the air. Now, I'm going to turn on this modulator that's tuned to 31. And watch what happens. Master, why do you speak in parables whenever a crowd is near? The knowledge of the secrets of the kingdom of God have been given to you. And there it is, an actual broadcast in the house on an analog signal. So now it simulates that channel 31 is on the air. And to prove it, we'll go to another television and show you the range. Okay, we're back at the analog television, the one with the analog tuning. And as you can see, it's still on channel 62. Now, I'm going to go down the spectrum again. And there's channel 31. So as you can tell, the signal carries very well to this TV because it's directly above the antenna source. Now to prove that the signal is going to weaken the further you go, I'm going to show you back on the Hitachi TV with this channel. Okay, we're back here on the Hitachi TV and as you can see this is still on channel 62. So what we're going to do now is go down the spectrum on this TV until we get to 31. And there's 31. Now, this may look very clear to you right now, but I can guarantee that if I went outside, it would not come in because those modulators are not meant to pass through block walls so there's no uh, there's no high concern of the signal being transmitted all the way to a neighboring house because the signal is very very weak but here it looks very clear and part of the reason too is that there's no other uh, modulators turned on but that's how you can simulate an analog broadcast if you'd like to watch say a digital cable channel in another room or a videotape or a DVD or you can even use that kind of source to monitor your home or your yard. Now, the only thing I recommend on that is I would not use the over the airwave signal. I would wire it directly with the coax because all the modulators, they have a coax connection where it, it becomes a closed circuit. So that way the uh, the signal doesn't go over the air and something that isn't supposed to be broadcasted will be broadcasted so that's what you have to be very very careful of so any kind of security setup it is better if you go directly with a cable hookup and then there's no chance of anything being transmitted over the air that shouldn't be so now in the next video, we'll show you how all the modulators work together, meaning that I will go around and show you how each one works in different locations of the home, and you'll see the difference of the signal on each TV.